All right, one of my favorite features of this radio is actually what we call the favorites feature, and it really allows you easy access to the things that you use most often uh, in the radio. So to give you an example, when you use the favorites feature, it has its own dedicated button. We call it the star key. So obviously it's got a star on it. You tap that button. Now it gives you up to eight of the, your most favorite things that you want to do on the radio. So you can see the way I have mine set up, I've got three Bluetooth phone contacts in here. I've got uh, three navigation uh, points in here, and I've also got a couple of audio uh, points as well, so Sirius XM channels. So I'll give you an example of how those work. So for example, with Sirius XM, if I want to if I want to set this up, not only does it take me to Sirius XM, but it takes me directly to the channel that I want to hear. So I've got Classic Rewind, one of my favorites, it takes me directly to Classic Rewind. If I want to go back to my favorites button and go to find a gas station, for example, I can tap the gas station button. Not only does it take me into navigation, but it takes me directly to the search list and finds me a list of gas stations based on the location that I am. So you can see the closest one is a mobile that's 0.4 miles away. Um, another good example would be restaurants, works the same way. So I can tap the restaurant button, when I'm hungry, I can find a list of restaurants that are closest to furthest to my location. Okay? And uh, things like home, I can tap the home button, direct, takes me directly to my home address. Works the same with Bluetooth phone contacts. So um, I've got Alpine set up in here, it's a one touch, comes up with Alpine's number, touch the call button, and now I'm calling work. So it makes it really, really simple to get to where you want to go. Now, this can also be done for two different users. So, for example, I have this one set up for me. Um, if you push and hold the star button, it allows you to set up a second user. So, now, I haven't set this one up yet, so we'll show you quickly how, to, how that setup process works. So, we hit start. We're going to pick a name. So, we'll pick wife. Hit OK. Now, it also gives you the opportunity to link a Bluetooth phone to this. So that way it automatically knows by the Bluetooth phone being linked to it, who's in the car. Now, we don't have a second phone linked to this one, so we're gonna hit do not link, just to give you the example of how it works, okay? And now you can see it comes up with a few kind of common type um, presets that you would normally wanna have. What's great about the system though is it allows you to customize. So I can hit the plus button, okay? And I can add different sources. For example, I can add a radio, I can add FM preset, and I can pick any one of the presets that I have, and then it's going to put that up on the favorite screen. Okay? I can also do things like phone contacts. So for example, I can do a search, I can type in whoever I want to have in here, so we'll put my name in here, hit OK, it's going to find that phone contact. It's going to allow me to add it to the actual thing. Okay, so now you can see I'm in there as a phone contact. Okay, you can do the same thing with navigation. So let's add another navigation. We can go to navigation, we go to POI category, and let's say we want cafe or bar in there. So we can add that one, and now you've got cafe or bar, um, the actual um, cafe or bar built into this. Okay, now. There's a couple other things you can do while you're on the setup. We've got six of these that are built in. We can do up to eight, but once you're in this, this setup mode, you can actually edit each one of the titles and you can move these things around as well. So we'll show you how to do that. So you go into the edit mode. Um, I'll tap on FM preset one. I can actually name that whatever I want. So I can name that, let's say um, rock, for example, okay, or hip hop. This actually happens to be a hip hop station. So we'll put hip hop on there. And that will now name that preset. You can name that anything that you want. Okay? You can also move these around. So exa for example, if I want all my audio in one place, I can take and drag this one down here, get the audio ones together, get the uh, navigation ones together all on the top. So once that's done, I can hit OK. And now I've completed my favorite setup. So you can see it really gives you an easy way to personalize a unit and make it work for the types of functions that you use daily. Driving Mobile Media Solutions. Alpine.